run any further, you would have caught up. A feet toe to toe with Yoi Mia! I've outran lots of adults before. Uh, long legs don't necessarily mean you run faster. Training's important, too. <laughs> I won't even be able to compete with you in a few years. Hmm, let's see. Where should we go next? <gasps> Look! Something's floating up ahead! Does it want us to follow it? Hmm, maybe. Let's follow it. Want to keep chasing after it? You're not feeling worn out yet? Getting tired is part of running. And I love everything about running. Here. They're big enough to lie on. That's not what they're for. Let me show you. Oh, so it's for jumping? So, this is our destination? But Paimon doesn't see an Aranara, just this big stone. I'm so happy. I almost forgot how it feels to be this happy. You know, at first, it felt like my world had shrunk down to a tiny space. But as long as I continue moving forward, new sights will always appear in front of me. My world will keep expanding before my eyes. Even though I don't know how I did it, I know I have you all to thank. Oh, that's not important. What's important is that you remember the joy of going through the world. Our memories don't just symbolize our past, they can also shine a light in our future. Once you find the hope in your heart again, that happiness will come back to you. Yes. Thank you, you and Mia. Thank you all. Let's keep looking for Arashani. It doesn't look like he's here. Yeah. Uh, then why would the star lead us here? I don't know how to explain this. I don't know what it is, but it feels very familiar. Almost like it's a part of me. I know. Could this stone be your Earthstone? Er Earthstone? It's a very rare ore that symbolizes a person's aspirations and dreams. Since you can see it, that means you've found what you've lost. Is that how it works? It's just like in fairy tales. I thought I'd stopped believing in those. But I'm glad that I found that belief again. them. Hey! Yoi Mia! Hey! <sighs> well, we have no choice. We passed through, but nothing seems to have changed. Arashani? Arashani! <laughs> the r 
is sure of a flair for magical journeys. They not only helped Devine find her best friend, but they also showed us what an Earthstone is. Oh, uh, we have to look for one of our own later, to make the purest lens. Yep. It's kind of funny, but Paimon thinks we can actually do it! But we have to bring her back to Sumeru City first. Her mother must be worried sick. It... The dream ended. We dreamed a most lovely dream. Don't look so lonely. He's right next to you. Okay, I understand. This happened because I lost sight of myself. But I think I understand now. Yoemiya's right. Everyone gets bad luck, but we had to support each other through unlucky times. Thanks for helping me rediscover my memories and dreams. I won't let your work go to waste. <laughs> You've also helped us a lot, so don't be so humble. To be honest, we didn't know where to start with the Earthstone. But now that we're on this track, I think we'll find it easy. Yoimiya, you need this Earthstone because you want to see a meteor shower? Yep. Oh, once we find it, you should come with us. If that's how things are... I'm happy to lend you my stone. What? What just happened? Did you just take glasses out of your chest? <laughs> How'd you know we need this? I didn't. I just thought that since you helped me find my precious friend, I should help you using something precious to me. And then the light turned into this. Is this what you needed? Thank you. I didn't expect us to solve our problem like this. All right, time to give it a go. Not that I know how to use it, but let's see what my intuition says. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, I think I see it! Oh, it was, uh, pretty obvious. Come on, I'll lead the way. Once we're done watching the meteor shower, I'll accompany you home. Also, thank you for helping us. Uh, actually, let me scrap the pleasantries and give you a heartfelt compliment instead. You all are great storytellers.
Fireworks. we summoned flew up from the ground. They were exactly like fireworks. Ugh, I could have kept watching that forever. That was the realest, grandest, most magical dream I've ever had. Paimon too! Paimon didn't expect you to just pull us onto that shooting star, though. <laughs> Honestly, I didn't think about it at all. I just... I thought it'd be a shame if we didn't try something crazy. <laughs> you know me. It really doesn't matter to me if our experience was real or a dream. I really should thank you two, though. You set all this up as a backup plan because you knew that meteor showers are hard to catch, right? Don't worry. I loved it so, so, so much. I I think this ranks as the absolute best gift I've ever been given. Oh, whew. that's good. Paimon was afraid you might be angry after hearing the truth. Why would I be? I dreamed about helpful, friendly, cute Aranara. I dreamed that we ran and jumped atop large mushrooms and we discovered Earthstone in a very unexpected way. And when I thought we had woken up, the next part was even more amazing. From her heart, a fiend brought forth Earthstone glasses. We found meteors that blew up from the Earth. And we even became one with the shooting stars themselves. That's right. Dreams themselves may be imaginary. They're also experiences that can never be relived or replicated. If we were sticklers about truth and fiction, we would have missed out on so much beauty and emotion. <laughs> you sure know your way with words. Paimon's gonna bump you up a few places on the Paimon's best friend list. Um, by the way, the Aranara, they don't usually like, uh... Oh, yeah! They're so cute! We really have to thank those lovely carvings. The wood carvings? Yeah! If we hadn't seen those wood carvings, then we wouldn't have dreamed of such cute Arunara. Huh. <laughs> Don't worry, I know. I think they're very cute, and I'm happy to protect them. Well, it's almost time. Let's send her home. A nice place. I'll be back for sure. You will always be welcome here. Avine would be happy to see you again. It's a deal. I'll be waiting for you. <laughs> you got it. Yoimiya, before you go back, I want to tell you about my new dream. I want to travel to Inazuma on my own and watch a fireworks show there. Wow, that's impressive. <laughs> I didn't expect to be introduced to new customers while on vacation. Don't worry, I'll make you some fireworks that you'll never forget. You too as well. No matter how busy your adventures get, remember to come back to Inazuma. We'll always welcome you no matter when you drop by. You gotta come and watch the fireworks this meteor shower inspired as they soar high in the sky. Sounds like a plan.
I will, I will. <laughs> You're as earnest as ever. Oh yeah, by the way, have a look at this. That's right, this is the one you helped me pick. And you said it looked kind of like me. I went to buy another one. This one's for you. Look at it whenever you're feeling down. Who knows? Maybe I'll raise your spirits. If nothing else, you'll know that I'm supporting you all the way. Of course, meeting in person is still better. <laughs> okay, I'll be heading back now. I'm sure we'll meet again soon. I really loved the trip you prepared for me. In fact, I'm totally impressed. No matter where you two go, I know that our friendship and its warmth will support you. So, go forward. To the end of your journey, and to the ends of this world! See you around!